there's actually a garage sale across the street right now and I'm trying to like look if there's any good pieces. Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having an amazing week. For today's video, I had asked you guys which one you would prefer seeing. It was between the thrift flip and the living room reveal. And to be honest, guys, it was pretty much a tie. So I just went with the thrift flip um, because I had that one done and ready to go. And I wanted to put it out there for you guys. For today's video, I had found three pieces that were cheap and that I thought had potential to revamp and just spruce them up. So for my first piece, I saw this simple mirror, but I love the shape of it. I love the color of the frame around the mirror and the size. I am redoing my closet sort of beauty room and I thought it was gonna be the perfect mirror to put where I'm going to be doing my makeup, the makeup station. So what I end up doing, which was a little bit more tedious because that mirror was actually, I couldn't take the frame, the mirror off the frame. It was glued on, I couldn't remove it. And I was, I wanted to do that because it would have been an easier process to just wrap around the raffia. But obviously it had to be harder for me. So I went piece by piece and stuck it one by one. Uh, normally you guys can just wrap it around, but anyway, I thought it was well worth it because I did love the end result and I thought it was worth me doing all that, gluing each piece. We're gonna jump right into the first thrift flip and I hope you guys enjoy it. So for my second thrift find, I was super happy when I saw this sitting in the store. I saw a whole bunch of people around it, so I kind of went to it really fast. And I was looking everywhere for a chair to put in the corner of my closet where you can just sit and if I want to talk to somebody, I mean my husband or whoever, and they want to come hang out while I'm doing my makeup, I have a chair there. It was a wicker, I'm not too sure what you call it, I think it's a Papa San chair, I'm probably butchering the name, but anyway, it's one of those round chairs that you can sort of take apart and has a pillow in it, a pillow seating. It came with the pillow seating cover, but I, you guys know how I feel about pillows, so when I went to the cash, I told the lady that was there, keep the pillow. I'm just gonna take the base of the chair and I'm gonna figure out how to do my own pillow seating thing. I end up going to the hardware store. I end up picking a painter's tarp and it was, I think in cotton, but it looks sort of like a linen feel to it. So I wash that, I end up cutting it in a circle and end up sewing it. But I'm gonna tell you guys, I am not a professional sewer. I don't have a sewing machine. I definitely need to learn how to use one because by the end, my fingers were gonna fall off. <laughs> but anyway, I'm super happy about the end result. If you guys do have a sewing machine, it can be much faster and probably have a cleaner, more refined 
a finish to your pillow but I'm still happy about the end result I think I did a pretty good job considering I did it by hand we're gonna jump right into it enjoy guys final thrift flip. I found this piece prior to me moving into this new home. I had envisioned it probably on a nightstand or a dresser. I just fell in love with the shape of it and the bulkiness to this lamp. The only thing, and I'm sure you guys know, was the color of the lamp. It was just not something that was suitable for my home decor. I'm sure for someone else's home in the right setting, it can look beautiful, but for my home, it just didn't fit. So I had envisioned adding a little dimension, texture to it, and just putting it a different color. So what I did was I ended up using plaster. I played around with the plaster, just yeah, added dimension. I spray painted it and then I used a little bit of acrylic paint to warm it up. Then I found a lampshade at Winners and I found it for $16.99. The price of the base of the lamp was $9.99. So a total of $30 and I had a beautiful lamp. I'm super happy about the end result. I feel it has a little bit of a restoration hardware feel, a little bit, but in my own cat's away, uh, which I love so much. I hope you guys love it as much as I do. And anyway, let's jump right into it.
So that's it guys. I hope you enjoyed this thrift flip. And I know I had mentioned that I was going to be doing a living room reveal, but I still have a few things that I want to tweak before I do the reveal. So I was thinking for my next video, I was going to take you guys along with me at thrift shopping, or I've been going a lot to winners in the home sense section, and I think it's called home goods in the States. And maybe taking you guys along with me on my little shopping excursions, maybe doing a mini haul afterwards. So comment down below, let me know if this is something that you guys would want to see. Thank you so much for watching. You guys are the best and I can't say it enough. I'm so grateful for all the love and support and all the thumbs up and all the beautiful comments you guys give me. Have an amazing day, an amazing week. I love you guys always. Mwah.